Minimum Alveolar Concentration, Wikipedia Article Audio Minimum alveolar concentration or MAC is the concentration of a vapor in the lungs that is needed to prevent movement in 50% of subjects in response to surgical stimulus. MAC is used to compare the strengths, or potency, of anesthetic vapors. MAC was introduced in 1965. Formal Definition Meyer Overton Hypothesis Altered MAC Common MAC values MAC actually is a median value, not a minimum as term implies. The original paper proposed MAC as the minimal alveolar concentration, which was shortly thereafter revised to minimum alveolar concentration. A lower MAC value represents a more potent volatile anesthetic. Other uses of MAC include MAC bar, which is the concentration required to block autonomic reflexes to nociceptive stimuli, and MAC awake, the concentration required to block voluntary reflexes and control perceptive awareness. The MAC is the concentration of the vapor that prevents patient movement in response to a supramaximal stimulus in 50% of subjects. This measurement is done at steady state, under the assumption that this allows for an equilibration between the gases in the alveoli, the blood, and the brain. MAC is accepted as a valid measure of potency of inhalational general anesthetics because it remains fairly constant for a given species even under varying conditions. The MAC of a volatile substance is inversely proportional to its lipid solubility. In most cases, this is the Meyer Overton hypothesis put forward in 1899 1901 by Hans Horst Meyer and Charles Ernest Overton. MAC is inversely related to potency, i.e., high MAC equals low potency. The hypothesis correlates lipid solubility of an anesthetic agent with potency and suggests that onset of anesthesia occurs when sufficient molecules of the anesthetic agent have dissolved in the cell's lipid membranes, resulting in anesthesia. Exceptions to the Meyer-Overton hypothesis can result from Certain physiological and pathological states may alter MAC. MAC is higher in infants and lower in the elderly. Also, MAC increases with hyperthermia, hypernatremia and chronic alcohol ingestion. Likewise, hypothermia, hypotension, and pregnancy seem to decrease MAC. Duration of anesthesia, gender, height and weight seem to have little effect on MAC. Opioid analgesics and sedative hypnotics, often used as adjuvants to anesthesia, decrease MAC. It should also be noted that MAC values are additive. For instance, when applying 0.3 MAC of drug X and 1 MAC of drug Y the total MAC achieved is 1.3 MAC. In this way nitrous oxide is often used as a carrier gas to decrease the anesthetic requirement of other drugs. Values are known to decrease with age and the following are given are based on a 40-year-old. Convulsant property of an agent, specific receptor, CO administration of alpha-2 agonists and slash or opioid receptor agonists can decrease the MAC. Mullins critical volume hypothesis, positive modulation of GABA at GABA-A receptors by barbiturates or benzodiazepines. Nitrous oxide, 104, xenon, 72, desflurane, 6.6, ethyl ether, 3.2, sevoflurane, 1.8, n-flurane, 1.63, Isoflurane, 1.17, halothane, 0.75, chloroform, 0.5, methoxyflurane, 0.16.